So in this video, I'm going to try to explain to you how you can sync the ARIA Compact series, in this case the S1 to the D8, and this is, this is also applies to any synth that has a sync port. And for that, you're going to need a mono cable, a mini jack mono cable, with mono or a stereo will also do. In this case, we're going to use the the mono, but if you don't know the difference, mono just has one, one black thing, it's just one channel, and the stereo has two, this is two channels, normally left and right, and in this case we're gonna use the the mono, so you have one thing that you have to know, one is the master, and the other one going to be the slave, or the other ones, you can change, change them, and um, so in this case we're going to make the the S1 the master, you're going to take the sync out from the S1 and you're going to put it in the in sync in at 8 Let's turn them on. Let's choose the pattern here. I think this one, let's move it. Okay, as you can see, so like 150, so 150, the S1 and 110, the Holland, this is the tempo, huh? In the minute that I plug the sync in, the T8 loses its tempo, so it's going to follow the tempo from the S1. And this also applies to any other synth. You can then take the out here and plug it in the in, in another one. Uh, so, to be able to hear, the ARIA Compact is this great feature that nobody speaks about, that there's this mix out. So, the audio, you can send the audio. So, we're going to take the, the stereo cable, because the S1 is stereo. You're going to take the, the mix out and to the mix in. So, now you're going to be able to hear the S1 also in the T8 and then I'm going to take the out in the T8 and plug it to my camera that you in this way you're going to be able to hear so this is T8 and hopefully we can hear also the S1 so they are in sync if I play, press play in the S1 only the S1 starts and we have to also press play in the T8 we should be able to do it in, in tempo. So if I slow <coughs> the S1, the T8 is also automatic slow. So one way to have both in tempo is to press at the same time. right so but sometimes we don't want to start both at the same time one thing to consider consider is that in the menu if they don't if one is running faster or, or slower than the other one there is a, a option in the menu let's see here this is s c link i don't know what this mean is it so and let's press enter this is four and this one should be also before so they have to match if they don't match one so let's play again so if these numbers don't match They will be in tempo, but one runs slower. In this case, or faster, if I make a smaller number here. So, but if I put it in the same number, they will be again in, in sync. So, if we have problems when you plug. When you plug the the sync, you know that this is this option in the menu. 
let's see, so this S, C, L, Y, the, this number has to match. Yeah? I can also do the other way around, let's take it now the, the T8, the master, so in this case we're gonna take the out from the T8, I'm gonna plug it in the in, the S1, and yet now the S1 lose the tempo, so it's falling the 120 here, Let's change the tempo yet now in the T8. So. so that's the way you do it. Hope this this was helpful. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. If you have any, any comments, any doubts, any questions, please leave in the comments. I'll be glad to answer and see you next time. the sequence.